there are so many scams out there these days that we really have to be vigilant in keeping ourselves safe from them. Scams are getting more sophisticated. So here are a few steps to view a little bit safer from scams. Emails, number one, if it's from somebody that you're not sure of, even if it's from somebody that you think it could be legit from, go up and have a look at the sender and see if it's a legit address. Number two, don't click links in emails. You get an email from the bank and they say, click this link to see your statement or click this link to check your account. Don't. Delete the email, go into your bank app and log on that way. Number three, just like links, don't open attachments on emails. If it's not from somebody that you know, because you've checked that address line at the top, then do not click on those attachments because you were probably downloading some sort of malware onto your computer. Four, read the email. If it starts with, dear sir, madam, and not your name or not Mr, Mrs, whatever surname, then chances are it's a scam. Read it slowly and carefully because the grammar will usually be bad and the email will kind of not make sense. Number five, even if it looks like it's from their letterhead, it doesn't make it legit. And text messages, exactly the same. Never click on a link to open. Phone calls. Scammers are getting very, very sophisticated with phone calls. They will tell you that they're from the bank. They will sound legit from the bank. They could tell you that your bank account has been hacked and you need to move everything out of that account into a new account. It can sound also legit. Do not fall for it. If you feel that something may be amiss, then hang up, ring your bank. Not with the number they gave you. Look up the number and ring the bank. Go online and log in using your app. Or better still, go down to the bank and speak to them in person. Do not believe anything you are told in a phone call, especially when they want you to transfer money out of where it is into something new. Or they want you to change your password or your PIN number on the line. That's just not how legitimate businesses work. Parcels. You get a text message to say, your parcel is delayed. Please click this link. Don't click the link. You know whether you've bought parcels or not. You'll get phone calls from Amazon. Ignore them. They are scams. Just go in to the apps, go onto the websites and check for yourself. Do not do it through a link. Social media. There are so many scammers out there now that are trying to target people and take their life savings. Don't fall for scams where people are trying to be really nice to you and want to be your friend and want to have a relationship. They never want to meet in person. They're suddenly stuck overseas and they need money to get home, but that money didn't fall come through, so they need more money. Please please, please do not fall for those scams. They target lonely people. I hope this has helped somebody out there from not losing their life savings, not being hacked.